In this tutorial, you'll learn how to intercept requests with BERT Proxy. BERT Proxy lets you intercept HTTP requests and responses sent between BERT's browser and the target server. This enables you to study how a website behaves when you perform different actions. Go to the Proxy Intercept tab. Click the Intercept is Off button so that it toggles to Intercept is On. Click Open Browser. This launches Burp's browser, which is pre-configured to work with Burp right out of the box. Position the windows so that you can see both Burp and Burp's browser. Using the browser, try to visit portswigger.net and observe that the site doesn't load. Burp Proxy has intercepted the HTTP request that was issued by the browser before it could reach the server. You can see this intercepted request on the proxy intercept tab. The request is held here so that you can study it and even modify it before forwarding to the target server. Click the forward button several times to send the intercepted request and any subsequent ones until the page loads in Burp's browser. Due to the number of requests browsers typically send, you often won't want to intercept every single one of them. Click the intercept is on button so that it now says intercept is off. Go back to the browser and confirm that you can interact with the site as normal. In Burp, go to the proxy HTTP history tab. Here you can see the history of all HTTP traffic that has passed through Burp proxy, even when interception was switched off. Click on any entry in the history to view the raw HTTP request along with the corresponding response from the server. This lets you explore the website as normal and study the interactions between Burp's browser and the server afterward, which is more convenient in many cases.